Hey Ray, welcome back. We can explore Rock Village now, which we've already been that way. We've already been that way. We went that way last time. That was we let in we let in Green Eco Boy. Now we can go this down into the actual village itself, and I can walk past an egg and then almost die. Well, not die, but fall off. 180 eggs. We might be able to like just try and buy the way out of eggs already. Right. Need 45 power cells to carry on. Which I feel like we've almost got. <laughs> yeah. We've almost got. It shouldn't even be that difficult. So, is this the, um... So, there is, a, like, a blue bit of eco here that you can, like, grab and then run all the way to this thing here. I'm not sure where that is. Uh, hey, dude. Dark the of one of you. Bring me 120 precursor orbs for each power cell I contain. Ivor. Right, Later, when I got enough. Hello. You two look like a couple of capable fellows. I've got a research project going, and maybe you could help me out. Hey, we're the ones on a big quest here. We ask you for help. Well, perhaps we can help each other. I've been studying the burrowing habits of lightning moles in the precursor basin next to our village for years. But now those uh -huh. awful lurkers have scared the moles to the surface. Oh. And since they're blind as bats, they awful. can't find their way back underground. If you could herd them back into their burrowing tunnels, you might just save their lives. I've got a power cell that says you can do it. Yeah, lightning mole. We can. Maybe for two power cells. Nice try. But I would be willing to part with another power cell if you two find me 90 precursor orbs for my research equipment. Fair enough? 90 bucks? I can do that. Oh, you have the orbs. Here's a power cell we agreed upon. Thank you. Easy orb. Um, okay, well, we can go do that. Uh, we can do that next time. Alright, so we grab this. We can just make it, make it. Oh. So we can't quite make it. This stone is very old. Stone is very old, huh? You are an archaeologist. I don't think we can get over there with just the one. Nah, we can't. We can't get over here with just the one. Where's the other one? The other one's here. What if we, like, run this way? Hang in there. Like, just past it? You know what I mean? Just, like, grab it as we go by. Maybe if we do get hit by the rock as well. No, that was definitely not. That was definitely not the way to go. Okay, well, there's one there, one there. Is there one somewhere else too? No, it doesn't look like it. Let's go that way. Now I can get back to my research. Maybe if we grab that one, then grab the other one. Uh, let's try that. Will. No, I didn't want to get stuck. Wait. No, it's just blue. I must, did you see like a, like a little blue spark come out of one of those barrels? Ah, oh, fuck. This fucking boulder, man. It's kicking my ass. Mm, this stone is very old. The stone's very old. Close. Do you think rolling is quicker than running with the electricity? Mm, 
No, I can't get through here. Oh, I don't know. I don't know how to do it. I cannot remember. It's gotta be something to do with those blue blue orbs. Maybe we just just gotta not suck. You know? That is that is a possibility. Hello. Sure, I was tough once. Maybe even the toughest of them all. Oh. Single-handedly defended this village from those horrid creatures for almost a year. Then that horrible monster arrived and commenced the boulder bombardment. So, full of valor, armor shining in the sun, I climbed the hill to take him on. But he pounded me like one tenderizes a yakow steak. Have you tried attacking him with your melodrama? Cause it's killing me! After my last stunning failure, he sealed the passageway to his roost with a 30-ton boulder, leaving no way for anyone to challenge him again. So, our sage, a master of blue ego, and yeah. a mechanical genius, devised a machine capable of lifting the boulder it out looks of the It looks great. It looks good. But alas... Disappeared before we had a chance to turn it off. Lifting the boulder. And he took all of his power cells with him. At least I was able to pull enough pontoons out of our bridge to prevent that monster from coming down here to do me harm. Yeah, good, good job, tough guy. But uh, we're, we're gonna need you to uh, put him back and stuff. Oh sure, and seal my doom. <sighs> all right. Bring Thanks, dude. 90 precursor orbs and I'll let the pontoons loose. What? But I'm not going to fight that monster again. Do you want me to get any bucks to fucking put the put the things back? <laughs> Jeez. Alright. Oh. Wonderful. You brought me the precursor orbs. Alright. I'll fix the bridge, but don't ask me to get involved with that creature again. Okay. Is that growing your cheeks, dude? Oh, that guy's a power cell too. Dope. Not sure why that would have got us a power cell, but all right. Hey. against the monster up there. And trust me, the smart money's on the monster. That wager pretty much tapped me out. So, I got a proposal. Bring me 90 orbs to get me back on my feet and out of this barrel, and I'll give you a power cell in return. And if you're game, I do have one more bet online. My big comeback. Beat the record time racing Dead Man's Gorge in the Precursor Basin, and I'll get a pretty payoff. For that, I'll give you another power cell. Okay. So, so he's not wearing any pants under there, right? Because he couldn't afford his pants. But surely... <laughs> surely pants are cheaper than a barrel. <laughs> you know? I mean, I don't know. I'm, I'm no fucking expert, obviously. But I feel like it might be a little bit cheaper, maybe? Well, unless he's like stole the barrel, I guess. The barrel was just transporting something. He was like, "Well, a barrel will do." Then again, then he put suspenders on it. Where is this though? This is the swamp. Oh, I don't want to do the swamp. I don't want to do the swamp. The swamp is not yet. Not yet. Uh, was that over there? How do I get that way? I think you're going go that way. Well, what was that? What was that big water ripple? I don't know. It was freaking scary. Oh, this is this one. All right, got you, Franks. Forty-five power cells. We're on it. We're doing it now. 
We're getting all the junk. Don't you worry. We're going to find every single power cell. Every single one. We'll get them. How do I get down? This is this is not correct. <laughs> well, whatever, I'm down here now. Oh, that was all. That was all seven of them. We did it. Okay, so we need 240 orbs, then bring 90 back to that guy. Alright, and there's a swamp which we ain't even touched yet. It's the swamps. Fuck. Because the swamp's a bit of a pain in the ass. Alright, how the hell do we do this? I think we gotta, we gotta, you just gotta move, you know? You just gotta move. We move well and quick. Do you reckon we could actually do it if we were, if I was good at video games? I've done it before. I swear I have. Now I can get back to my research. Great. I'm so happy for you. Hmm. There's not more than just that, is there? There's not like a third one somewhere. Like a secret third. Oh, we fucking... We did it! I feel like maybe the game just kind of... <laughs> I feel like the game kind of just gave that to me. There's ten more uh, orbs around here somewhere, apparently. I don't know where they are. Oh, actually, maybe I do. Maybe I do know where those ten orbs are. I think they're over there. Okay. This is like the big, uh, like temple, right? This is the water temple. We can, we can probably do this. Do we want to do the water temple? Right, we gotta get over to that, over to that bit. Up. Done. Oh, fifty bucks. All right. Uh, okay, now we want to go into this thing here. Oh. Now we're all underwater and it's dark. There's weird green water. Oh, yeah, okay. All right, well, we'll deal with this nightmare next time. Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, leave a like and a comment down below. And I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.